Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we're going to be doing what May will bring for you. Yesterday I recorded what the summer months are going to bring and you can check that out on my channel. Um, today we're going to be doing what the month of May is going to bring. So I already shuffled the cards and I'm going to go ahead and show them to you. We're going to start out with our mindful message. So for our first one we have recharge and it says i invite magic into my life always every day i grow my my connection to this earth if i'm ever feeling low i simply step outside and appreciate the natural miracles in this life being in nature lifts my spirits and recharges my energy so recharge i'm gonna put that right there and for our next card we have Abundance, and it says, Divine Beloved, please show me how to feel fully deserving to receive. I release my ego's plan and open to being a vehicle for abundance. So, so far, it seems like May might be starting off on a good, good note with some abundance. And for our next car, we pick two of those. So we have Relationship. I call in the infinite power of love to take over this union in every way. May it now fully belong to the divine. Let it unfold in the perfect way for each of us. I needn't fear letting go of control. My needs are always abundantly met. So there's that word again, abundant. So it seems like May so far, we're going to have some abundance. And so uh, our next card is a color, color card. So, um, blue came out when I shuffled and it says activate your healing power. And then we got tranquility, violet. And this is the sign of Pisces. And there's a candle right there. So maybe the month of May, you might need to recharge you might need some tranquility, some gardening, uh, getting out in nature to recharge your soul and your spirit. Here's the next card we chose was family. Look at that big full moon. So you could be spending some time with your family in May. You might be going on a trip maybe spending time with your kids or your parents or just your whole family and you might be doing um, activities, games, um, just spending quality time with your, connecting with your family, recharging with your family. There might be an abundance of time spent with your family and re rekindling the relationship with your family. And the next card we have is flower. Be honest with yourself. So maybe there's um, something going on within your family that I'm picking up that maybe you might need to speak up to your family or be honest with your family about something in the month of May. And for our Moonology cards, we have Expect Powerful Change. So something is changing in May. Could be something with your family, your relationships. Um, you might be changing because this next card came out and it was a new start is coming. So the month of May is going to bring change and a new start. It could involve family. It could be a pregnancy. It could be a shift in abundance, a career pay increase, could be all of those things. And our next card we picked was Spirit Guardian of Autumn, Letting Go. And that card came out. And surprisingly, Wolf Spirit Family. So definitely the month of May is bringing some sort of change within your family. Maybe you're going to be spending more time with your family or 
you might be coming out with something to your family. You might be speaking your truth to your family. Finally, you might have been holding back for a while and finally you feel like it's time to speak your truth to your family and maybe fix a relationship or let go of a relationship. And our last card we got um, was change. So there's definitely big change coming for sure. Big change coming in May. But I feel like it's going to be good change, a much needed change. So whatever happens, it's going to be a new start. Definitely something with family. You're going to be activating your healing. So healing within the family, you're going to be recharging. Uh, and it's going to bring abundance. You're going to bring abundance to your family and to yourself. And it's just speaking your truth. And being honest with yourself. Have you been being honest with yourself? Um, yeah, they. I definitely feel family, letting go of a relationship or fixing a relationship, maybe uh, an apology within the family. But either way, the month of May is going to bring abundance, family time, a new a new start powerful change definitely something is changing in the month of may and it's going to recharge you it's going to energize you it's going to make you feel good and yeah i hope you guys like and subscribe i'll see you later bye